Hey guys, Russell Gunner here from Club Visio Plus. Today we're going to talk about what is the rotator cuff. We see a lot of people coming in all the time. Docs will tell you you've hurt your rotator cuff muscles, and a lot of people are like, oh, what exactly is that? Well, we know it's in the shoulder. Here's your shoulder right here. And there's four rotator cuff muscles. And who knows which one you've torn based upon an ultrasound. We can let you know, and also your doctor may tell you too. Tough to tell which one you've done yourself, but I'll give you a quick little try maybe. So we're looking at this shoulder here. This bone here is called the humerus. This is your shoulder bit, of course, and this is your collarbone. So if we're looking at on me, it's kind of like that right there. So the four rotator cuff muscles. you got one in the back of your shoulder here. This is called the infraspinatus. you got one on the top of your shoulder, which comes across the top of your shoulder, right on top through here, goes through here, and comes out a little groove through here, a little tunnel. That's called the supraspinatus. I'm not going to test you these, don't worry. One behind your shoulder, more... Back in this area through here, it's called the teres minor. And the last one's on the very front of your shoulder blade, comes across to your shoulder here too, called the subscapularis. And that one's on pretty much between your ribs and your shoulder blade. And that one, what does, that one does, is what's called internal rotation. It turns your arm inwards. So if you're pain going inwards, turning your arm inwards, okay, or against the resistance, like closing a car door or something, that could be the subscapularis. If you're having a problem with rotating it outwards, called external rotation, that could be a problem more with your infraspinatus or also your teres minor muscle we talked about in the back. And the main one, the one we see so many times in most rotator cuff issues, is the very top one there called the supraspinatus. It gets caught in there, it gets impinged in the top there, and that's where we have the most problems. Supraspinatus is a very important stabilizer your shoulder. It helps open your arm up a little bit too, but most importantly, it helps lower our arms. You may find you can do this no problem, but on the way down, it's like, oh, that hurts, okay? That could be your supraspinatus. So that's your four rotator cuff muscles. Very common to tear them with sports injuries such as tennis, basketball, volleyball, throwing injuries like baseball and so on. So if you have an issue with that, certainly give us a call. We see it all the time. We get some great success doing some different treatments with it. And we'll get you back out there as soon as you can. All right. Take care. Thanks. Bye-bye.